he's an incredible playmaker, got great arm, great athleticism. Um, he's got a great feel in the pocket. Uh, I think he does a great job knowing kind of when he needs to let go of the ball. You know, he does a great job kind of retreating in the pass rush and they don't really get home. And then he's got a nice release where he can, you know, just backpedal and then flick the ball off, you know, his, his back foot. Yeah, I think the biggest thing is our, the competitive drive. I mean, he, he's the same way as, as I am. He's going to leave everything he has on the field every single time he's out there um, to win. And he doesn't care what it takes. He doesn't care if he has to throw for 400 yards or if he has to throw for 100 yards. He wants to win. And when I was a kid, I grew up not liking Tom Brady because I was a Peyton Manning fan. And now I'm the biggest Tom Brady fan. So uh, it's great being able to catch the balls from him. I think everything he's been able to accomplish, you know, in the last 20 years, um, you know, we we just we, we haven't seen anyone be able to do it. You know, and I think him, you know, still playing at a high level, you know, he's playing in a, in a different system, you know, it's, it's different players um, and, and he's still, you know, setting the standard. You know, I got nothing but major respect for Travis Kelsey. Uh, he has helped uh, transform the tight end position. He has helped put the tight end position on the map, uh, you know, uh, and also, you know, just, you know, speaking of contract wise, he, he has helped the position, the tight end position get paid. Gronk's career has been unbelievable. Unbelievable. It's, it's going to go down in history as one of the best players that have ever played this game. On top of that, his his season, I think 2011, when he had 1,300 yards and 17 touchdowns and then went into the Super went all, took his team all the way to the Super Bowl. The guy is an unbelievable person, talent, you name it, man. I might be one of the biggest Gronk fans out there. Hi, Mahomes. How are you? I'm good. How are you doing? Good. So my question for you is, even though I'm a Bucks fan, can I still be a Mahomie? If so, what is a Mahomie? Oh, you can always be a Mahomie. Uh, a a Mahomie is, is just someone that loves to help others and, and loves to be a part uh, of the community and making the world a better place. In the event of a Super Bowl win, is there another cheeseburger waiting for you? There is, Mariano. Yes, I, I'm going to go. I need a double cheeseburger if that happens. I'm happy I'm in my own bed. I'm happy I'm eating uh, you know, good stuff at home. I'm happy I um, had extra time to prepare. Don't have to travel. Don't have to pack my clothes you know, pack up all my other crap. So uh, in our own locker room, in our own practice field, going to be in our own locker room. So in the end, I think it's, uh, there's some real positives to take from it. I started tricking them because I would bring a shirt, my shirt out, and then I would bring another shirt out. So when I'm running the sprints, I would film myself like 15 times for, for that session, that workout session. But I would run it in a couple different shirts because you only had to send in like two or three reps. So then when the next time came, I didn't have to film myself because I already filmed myself running in a different shirt. A player is going to ask the coach, how are you going to make me better? He doesn't really care if the answer comes from a male, a female, black, white, brown, yellow, who? I mean, just help me make, just help me be better because we're rich glorified school teachers. Best school teachers I ever had were all different races, all different ethnic groups and male and female. I've never beat... Rob Gronkowski and, and 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 Tom Brady in a in a playoff situation, and I'm very aware of that. And I I think uh, the AFC Championship game a couple of years ago um, has fueled me uh, to be more accountable for my teammates, to to mm -hmm. to be better out there on the field uh, when it's needed the most. No one can keep up with me, you know, because I ran track, I ran you know Olympics, you know, so. Somebody in the NFL? No, I don't. I don't. I don't really believe so. You know, I don't really feel the nerves, um, but I'm excited. I'm excited to be playing. You know, the first home Super Bowl in Tampa, and hopefully we can win it and make even more history.